Hey, it's Ed here. I found out something really neat about this uh, little copper aluminum battery. <clears throat> As you can see, what well, we get, we get about 0 0.62 volts off this right here. <clears throat> now, what I want to do, I'll show you. I'm going to take this and I'm going to put a little charge on it. Okay, going to <clears throat> charge it up with nine volts. Alrighty, now that it's charged up. <clears throat> see how much voltage we get off the thing. 1.52 volts. Okay. Now let's check the current on it. what we can get. I've got it sitting on 250 milliamps. I'm over a hundred. You can see that. Let's see. Looks like it dropped down. Let me do it again. Okay, we're down to 50 milliamps right now because I'm on the 250 milliamp setting and that's what we're getting up there. It's pretty cool. Alright, what I want to do now is I want to take that off of that. I want to try charging this little sucker up right here. Get these a little more on the damp side. Just going to put a little bit of salt water on them. Now, let's charge that up. So it kind of <coughs> lights we get. See if we get any crazy stuff going on. Okay. There. The negative. Okay. If I can get it to stay. <coughs> Charging up. And we'll see what happens. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what kind of current we get out of this. It's not doing as good. But one battery one seems to do fine. So what kind of voltage we got on this? Yeah, I'm on looks like three volts. Three point one volts. Something like that. Okay, just interesting. Bye.